What's going on y'all, Evan ACX Realtor, back with another property tour for you guys. We got a three-story uh, property here in the Shady Acres area. This property is a little over $500,000. It is just a touch under 3,000 square foot. It is a three bed, three bath, one half bath with a roof terrace, kind of a nice deal, and then a two car garage. So I'm gonna flip you guys around. You can kind of see how the levels are going to be uh, divided out or start at the bottom work our way to the top and then once we get to the top uh, you guys kind of tell me what you think all right if you would like to see this property in person be sure to contact me using the description below or reach out to me using your favorite social media platform all right y'all take care and I'll see you on the next one be safe drive safe and drink water I'll see you on the next one all right let's go ahead and get into this so here is the entryway as soon as you come into the property um, to the right is going to be your first bedroom and then to the left where we're going to go into right now is going to be the garage space. It's got enough space in my opinion for two cars. Um, if you want it to park in here, use it for storage, it's totally up to you. Um, and it's elevated here so that's really nice. This first bedroom has glass French doors on it. Um, I would use this or you could use this as an office, you could use this as a kid's playroom, I mean whatever you want. If you have a multi-generational house this would be nice. It has a full bath over here which you're going to see in just a second. So super super cool here. Uh, if somebody works the night shift they could live on the bottom and not disrupt anybody on the upper floors. We are here in a second going to look out the back. Um, this is like the back yard if you would, it's kind of small. All right, let's go ahead and move upstairs now. All right, let's go ahead and move to the second story here up the stairs. Nice little place you could put like some flowers right here. That would be really nice. Here is your living room with a fireplace. And this is like an entertaining level. All right, you have living room, dining room, and then your kitchen over here. Uh, let's go ahead and step into the living room. This would be nice. You could put a TV up against this wall over here where the fireplace is at. Oh, I was trying to show the exposed beams. Beautiful, beautiful exposed beams. And then they also did some woodworking in the ceiling, which I'll show you here in just a second. This is a big, big open space. You could have a huge sectional in here. You could have a long dining room right here. Look at the beautiful woodwork they did here in the ceiling. Just fantastic. It's just so nice. Oh, here's the first wine fridge of this property. There's actually three. So if you do a lot of entertaining, this is it. Super open kitchen area here. Uh, perfect for cooking. Uh, really, really nice oven here. Nice appliances just in general. A lot of wine storage or any kind of bottle storage. Currently we're standing in like a little breakfast nook area so you can kind of look out and see what's going on. Beautiful, beautiful, very intricate. Look how they did everything on the arches. Everything is so ornate in, in this house. It's probably one of the more ornate new construction builds I've ever seen. Um, high quality finishes everywhere that you look. This is such a super nice little house right here. Copper finished. Uh, and then as you can see across the street they actually got new construction coming up. Here's a really nice feature. There's a half bath right here. So say you're entertaining, people don't have to go into your bedroom or any other floor, so they can stay on this floor. They can use this little half bath right here. So convenient, super nice. All right, let's head up to the third floor. So this is going to be the floor that has two more bedrooms, specifically the primary and then the third bedroom, another wine fridge as mentioned. And then there's French doors right here and we'll check you out. We'll go down there here in just a second. One thing to note about this primary bedroom, or this master bedroom, it is humongous. Lots of space here. I'm sure you could fit, double check me, but I'm sure you could fit a king size bed in here. No problem, California king. Uh, just so nice. Really spacious bathroom here as we go over there. Lots of natural light, uh, super comfortable in here. Really, really nice. Imagine waking up to this double sinks nice little tub here great finishes throughout i mean high quality fixtures everything shower right here shower right here um and then a walk-in closet which has got a lot of space here i think i'm gonna show off the counter here yeah here we go just to show you the kind of little counter space that you could have here uh great walk-in closet space um and then here's your commode 
So the, the next place we're going to go here is going to be the third and final bedroom. Once again, talk about multi-generational housing or if you have roommates, friends, family, whatever you have. Oh, here's where the washer and dryer hookup is set. Um, talk about multi-generational housing. Everybody could have their own full bathroom, which is super nice. Nobody's waiting on anybody. Um, there's the new construction I was talking about. Uh, nobody's waiting on anybody and these ceilings super high ceilings it makes the rooms feel so large so here is the full bath that I was talking about really nice in here uh, like I said you can make this your own kids room roommates uncle brothers family whoever you have this would be great for them and then that's gonna be the fourth level here I just wanted to kind of show you what we're looking at here and then we can go upstairs. So this final room is where the roof terrace is at. You could use this like as a playroom. This would be really nice to kind of have like a game room up here. Uh, just a super cool area. It also has oh, another wine fridge. So and a little sink there. So three wine fridges in this property right here. Imagine having your friends and family over to enjoy the outdoors with this little uh, roof terrace here. And then I'm going to show you kind of what your view would be. If you would like to see this property in person, be sure to reach out to me using the information below. Be safe, drive safe, and drink water, people. This is going to be the end of this home tour. I would love to show this property to you or any other ones. Y'all take care and have a great day.